Jada is back at it here to give everyone another Big Bang Theory Season 1 episode review video. Before I get into that though, pretty important, if you are caught up to the point where I am and re-watching or watching Big Bang Theory, or you're just not entirely sure, then you definitely need to take the initiative and pay attention to the episode's title, which of course I'll mention as well as add in the description for you. If that happens to be the case and you're not caught up, it would be my recommendation that you don't watch this video any further simply to stay away from any potential spoilers, although it's a sitcom, so there's not many. This would be Big Bang Theory Season 1, Episode 10. The title of this episode is called The Lubenfeld Decay. This will be my review reaction recap after just finishing watching the episode last night. Starts off with Sheldon and Leonard uh, going up the stairs, or about to go up the stairs, arguing about something in the terminator franchise or just arguing about the franchise in general when all of a sudden they hear penny singing rather annoyingly but anyway they try to run back but to no avail as penny catches up with them and lets them know that she uh was offered a role in a play uh, of course that's a musical and i uh, penny of course invites them both and they leonard quickly declines and says no we have this science thing to do on friday night so we can't make it due to the fact that her singing is just atrocious which sheldon did not say anything leonard spoke for sheldon at that point in time and then later shortly thereafter leonard is sleeping it's really late in the morning and sheldon who knocks on the door three times leonard Leonard, Leonard, and Leonard's like, what? And he is, uh, he's feeling bad that Leonard included him in the lie and that the lie, if Penny researches it on the website, she'll be able to find out that there is no uh, conference or whatever specifically he mentioned to him was. And uh, Leonard's like, whatever, she's not going to research it. But anyway, so later the that morning, he, uh, he goes to Penny's house and wakes her up. Penny, Penny, Penny. And he actually confesses the lie to Penny, but makes up a different lie to Penny, saying that they're going to attend to his cousin, I believe, who is uh, dealing with some addiction issues. And I don't know. <laughs> uh, we find out that uh, his they're going to go see him. So they end up going. What happens is Howard and Raj show up to the apartment. And they're mad that they they wanted to go to the, the conference that they supposedly told Penny that they were going to. And then they tell Raj and Howard that, no, that's not what we're doing. We're going to, to Texas to attend. Or was it? No, was it California? I don't remember. He lives in Texas, but I think some the, the relative that he made up lives somewhere else that they were going to attend to him. So they all went there. I don't know what they did while they were gone. But when they're back, what they did to make this story even more of a lie is he brought somebody in from work, played by DJ Qualls, who is going to play his cousin as he has some drama and some acting uh, ability. And he's, you know, Leonard wakes up and he's like in the kitchen. And Leonard's like, who the fuck are you? And it's this uh, this person that's playing this role as a part, which it's really weird. Um, so what happens is Penny comes over shortly thereafter, and she's like, "Oh, great! You know what? I'm gonna let her come on over to uh, somebody videotape my performance, and I want you to see it. That way, I can be there right next to you to see your reaction of it." So Leonard gets screwed either which way because he didn't really want to see it live, but now he has to watch it with her. And sit through it. And then we don't see what happens during that part. But the end of the episode is Penny sitting next to the this Leo uh, Lubenfeld or Toby Lubenfeld character that Sheldon brought over from work. Watching TV and Sheldon standing next to Leonard in the kitchen saying, you have a lot to learn about lying and this Toby character has his head on Penny's shoulder. And that's that's the end of the episode. So while the episode had its moments, it was the, the debut of the knocking that I love that Sheldon does because it's so quirky that it works. I didn't really like the episode. I thought it was kind of bland in my opinion. I didn't research the score of this episode. I'm sure it probably is rated a little bit higher than what I'm about to give it. But I would only give it about a 6.6 .6 out of 10. 
And my character of the episode is Sheldon because he introduced the knocking in this episode. And I wonder what, what made them think to do that. So you've heard what I have to say. Now it's your turn. If you're a fan of Big Bang Theory, make sure you smash that like button. I love talking Big Bang Theory, so make sure you leave a comment in the comment section about your thoughts. Sound off. Tell me what you thought about the episode. Give me a score if you can make a score for the episode. And uh, tell me what your favorite uh, moment or whom was your favorite character of the episode. Of course, last but certainly not least, don't forget to hit that sub button. Subscribe to the channel. Join the team. Show your damn support to be a part of something special. And JDev will return.